Hello friends, my name is Prince and welcome again to the Mind Test Tech YouTube channel and in this lecture we will study about that how to print this type of pattern in the JavaScript friends. In our previous lecture we have studied about the opposite of that pattern in which we had the numbers that is 1, then 1, 2, then 1, 2, 3, then 1, 2, 3, 4 and last 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. But here our pattern is totally opposite friends. Here we first have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, then 1, 2, 3, 4, then 1, 2, 3, then 1, 2, and one that is pattern is decreasing friends that is it is in the decrementing order friends so how to print this type of pattern in the javascript let us see the working of that friends so this is the program of that pattern friends so here friends in our previous lecture we had here i value one but now we have here i value five in our previous lecture we had the value i less than equals to five and i plus plus but here it is totally opposite because the pattern is totally opposite friends so here we have i is equals to 5 i greater than equals to 1 and i minus minus in place of i plus plus so let us see the working of that so first of all here we have i greater than equals to 1 so i we have 5 so it will check the condition is i greater than equals to 1 i we have 5 so is 5 is greater than equals to 1 is 5 is greater than equals to 1 yes the condition is true if the condition is true then it will go to the inner for loop and the, in that for loop it is find that j value we have 1 and there is again the check condition that is j is less than equals to i so j we have is 1 so is 1 is less than equals to i what is i value i value we have is 5 friends so here we have to put here the 5 friends so is 1 less than equals to 5? Yes, the condition is true. If the condition is true, then it will print the this statement that is the document dot write and it will print the j value. Now j value we have is 1. So first of all, let me remove that friends. Done. Okay friends. Now it will print the j value. J value we have is 1. So it will print here the 1 friends. And after that, j++, plus plus, we increment the value of j. Now, the value of j will we have is 2 friends. And then again, it will check the condition is 2 is less than equals to 5. Yes, the condition is true. If the condition is true, now this statement will execute. And this statement will print the value of j. Now, the value of j is we have 2. So, it will print the value of j that is 2 here friends. And after that, if j++ plus plus is again increment the value of j, now we have the j value that is 3 here friends. And then again check the condition is 3 is less than equals to 5. Yes, the condition is true. If the condition is true, it will print the value of j. Now we have the j value that is 3 here friends. So 3. Again, j++ plus plus will increment the value of j. Now the j value is now we have 4. Condition is again true and then it will print the value of j. Now we have the j value that is 4 here friends. And last it will again increment the value of j. Now we will have j value that is 5 friends. Is the condition true friends? Yes, the condition is true. We know that 5 is not less than 5, but 5 is equal to 5, friends. So that's why condition is true, friends. If condition is true, then this statement will execute and it will print the value of j, that is j value we have is 5, friends. This value, friends. And after that, j++ we again also increment the value of 5, j. So we will have j6. Now the condition is totally false friend why because 6 is not less than equals to 5 6 is greater than 5 so if the condition is false friends then this statement will not execute friends now the loop has been terminated if the loop has been terminated then it will go outside of the loop and outside of the loop there is a statement document dot write and in that statement we have break tag and break tag is for the next line friends so it will insert the next line friends here Okay friends, now it will go to the outer for loop that is the first for loop here again and in that for loop there we have decrement operator friends and this decrement operator will decrease the value of i friends. We had the value of i5 now after decrementing we have the value of i that is 4 friends. Now we will again check the condition is 4 is greater than 1. Yes, 4 is greater than 1, so condition is true. If the condition is true, now it will again compare these values. J value we have 1, 
एंड आई वैल्यू वी हैव नाउ इज फोर फ्रेंड्स इज कंडीशन ट्रू यस कंडीशन इज ट्रू बिकॉज वन इज लेस देन फोर इफ वन इज लेस देन फोर दैन इट विल प्रिंट द वैल्यू ऑफ जे जे वैल्यू वी हैव वन जे प्लस प्लस अगेन इंक्रीमेंट द वैल्यू ऑफ जे नाउ वी हैव जे वैल्यू टू कंडीशन इज ऑल्सो ट्रू बिकॉज टू इज लेस देन फोर इफ कंडीशन इज ट्रू जे वैल्यू प्रिंट जे वैल्यू वी हैव टू जे प्लस प्लस विल अगेन इंक्रीमेंट द वैल्यू ऑफ जे नाउ वी हैव जे वैल्यू दैट इज थ्री हेव फ्रेंड्स कंडीशन इज ट्रू बिकॉज थ्री इज लेस देन फोर कंडीशन ट्रू जे वैल्यू प्रिंट जे वैल्यू वी हैव थ्री लास्ट अगेन जे प्लस प्लस विल इंक्रीमेंट द वैल्यू ऑफ जे नाउ वी हैव जे वैल्यू फोर कंडीशन इज वॉट कंडीशन इज ट्रू फ्रेंड्स फोर इज इक्व टू फोर कंडीशन इज ट्रू इफ द कंडीशन इज ट्रू दाउ जे वैल्यू इट विल प्रिंट द जे वैल्यू दैट इज फोर हेयर फ्रेंड्स एंड लास्ट जे प्लस प्लस अगेन इंक्रीमेंट द वैल्यू ऑफ जे नाउ वी हैव जे फाइव कंडीशन इज False friends, because five is not less than or equals to four. Condition is four false, so it will not print the value of J. Now it will go outside of the loop, and there we have break tag friends. Next time, again it will go there, and it will decrease the value of I that is three. Now it will this loop will go along this time, and after that we will have the values that is one, two, three, one, two. One. This loop will continuously goes like that, friends. Okay, and in the last, we will have here the value zero, friends. And then, if you will have the value zero, now the condition will be false, friends. And if the condition will be false here, because zero is not greater than or equals to one, condition is the false. Then this loop will also not execute. If this loop will not execute, then all these loops. will not execute all the statements will not execute friends because the condition is false now it will not go again ah okay so this is our desired pattern friends friends implement that program on your pc if you face any problem then please comment me and if you like my video then you can subscribe my channel so thank you take care bye bye